What keeps moths from freezing in the winter? Find out next on today's Creation Moment. And now, here's our Creation Moment host, Ian Taylor. As fall comes to the temperate regions of North America, Europe and Asia, many birds head for warmer climates and insects go into suspended animation. And while it might appear that nature is shutting down for the winter, amazing things are happening. About 50 species of moth are awakening from spending the summer in suspended animation. Winter is when they are active, despite the fact that they don't have any of the biological antifreeze that some other creatures do. The metabolic costs of such chemicals would hamper their way of life. Winter moths can live as they do, even though they freeze below 32 degrees, because they emerge from the leaf clutter on the forest floor, where temperatures almost never fall below 37 degrees. But when the air temperature rises above freezing, the moths emerge, shiver for a few minutes to warm up, and then begin to look for food. Maple sap is among their favorite foods. One stomach full of this high-energy food provides enough energy for one of these moths to hibernate all winter. Winter. And when they are active, they are able to increase their metabolism by over 8,000 times, using the same amount of energy in only 30 minutes. Summer moths shed heat from the thorax. Winter moths conserve their heat with an entirely different heat exchange system. Winter moths illustrate that there are no limits to what God can do. So if you are ever tempted to wonder how God could have made the entire creation in just six days, remember his winter moths. To get a complete set of transcripts from Creation Moments programs, ask about the book Letting God Create Your Day when you visit us online at creationmoments.com or give us a call at 1-800-42-BIBLE and join us again for another Creation Moment, proclaiming evidence of God's truth.